just want to ask her a question. I mean, it's just a feeling that she's really gonna come back and answer your question. Beneath the retreating glaciers and thawing permafrost, an extraordinary chronicle of Earth's history unfurls. As the planet's icy cloak melts away, it reveals astonishing secrets, long concealed in its frozen embrace. From the remnants of ancient civilizations, to the perfectly preserved remains of prehistoric creatures. This man who has been frozen for 40,000 years is still alive. Now, all signs lead to lead us to believe that he's been dead for a considerable amount of time. The thawing ice offers a tantalizing glimpse into a world lost in time. Join us as we delve into the most interesting and weird discoveries made inside ice. Number 20, Ancient Seeds. In the frigid depths of Siberia, Scientists made an astonishing discovery. Ancient seeds that had been buried in the frozen ground for a staggering 320,000 years. These seeds, which belonged to a plant known as Selene stenophylla, had been preserved in the burrows of long-gone ground squirrels, which had served as natural freezers for hundreds of millennia. The discovery of these ancient seeds was a true miracle, as they had managed to survive the eons in a state of suspended animation. The seeds were found nestled within the frozen layers of permafrost, which had acted as a natural time capsule, protecting them from the ravages of time and the elements. But the real magic happened when researchers attempted to bring these ancient seeds back to life. Incredibly, they were able to coax the seeds into sprouting, watching in amazement as new plants emerged from the ancient soil. These plants, which were genetically identical to their ancient ancestors, provided a fascinating window into the past, offering scientists a rare opportunity to study the flora of a long-gone era. Number 19, Frozen Wolf. In the frozen wastes of Siberia, a remarkable discovery was made. The remains of an 18,000-year-old canine that defied classification. This ancient creature, which was found perfectly preserved in the permafrost, had characteristics of both wolves and dogs, leading researchers to believe that it may represent an intermediate species that existed during the last ice age. The discovery of this enigmatic canine was a true marvel, as it offered an unprecedented glimpse into the distant past. The creature's remains were so well preserved that researchers were able to extract DNA from its bones and study its physical characteristics in detail. What they found was a creature that seemed to straddle the line between wolf and dog, with a mixture of traits from both species. This 18,000-year-old canine is thought to have lived during a time of great change when the world was emerging from the last ice age and the first human settlements were beginning to take shape. It is possible that this creature represents an early stage in the domestication of dogs when wolves were gradually becoming more accustomed to human presence and beginning to develop the traits that would eventually make them our beloved companions. Number 18, Frozen Negatives. Imagine stumbling upon a hidden treasure trove of photographs from over a century ago. That's exactly what happened in 2013, when a remarkable collection of old photo negatives from Ernest Shackleton's ill-fated Antarctic Expedition was discovered. Dating back to 1914, these negatives offer an unprecedented glimpse into the harrowing journey of Shackleton and his crew as they battled against the unforgiving Antarctic landscape. The negatives, which had been preserved in the icy depths of the Antarctic for nearly a hundred years, were found alongside photographs taken by the Ross Sea Party, a group tasked with setting up supply depots for Shackleton's expedition on the opposite side of the continent. The discovery of these long-lost images was a true marvel, as they had survived the ravages of time and the harsh Antarctic climate. As researchers carefully studied the negatives, they were transported back to a time of great heroism and sacrifice. The images captured the daily struggles of the expedition members as they faced unimaginable challenges, from treacherous ice flows to bitterly cold temperatures. The negatives also showcased the breathtaking beauty of the Antarctic landscape, with its towering glaciers and pristine snow-covered expanses. Number 17, Lion Cubs. In the frozen tundra of Siberia, a pair of prehistoric lion cubs were discovered, perfectly preserved by the icy embrace of time. These cubs, 
which are estimated to be around 12,000 years old, were found with their internal organs and soft tissues intact, offering an unprecedented glimpse into the world of these ancient felines. The discovery of these lion cubs was a true miracle, as they had managed to survive the ravages of time thanks to a series of fortuitous events. It is believed that the cubs, which were just a few weeks old at the time of their death, were likely killed by a landslide or some other natural disaster. Their bodies were then quickly covered by sediment and frozen in place, creating a natural time capsule that would keep them preserved for thousands of years. When the cubs were first discovered, researchers were amazed by their state of preservation. The cubs' fur, skin, and even whiskers were all perfectly intact, and their internal organs were still visible through their translucent skin. This remarkable level of preservation allowed researchers to study these ancient creatures in unprecedented detail, offering new insights into their anatomy, diet, and behavior. Number 16, frozen war relics. In the icy depths of the Arctic and the frigid waters of the Black Sea, a series of incredible discoveries have been made the frozen remains of soldiers and ships from some of the most pivotal moments in modern history. One of the most remarkable of these discoveries was made in 2005, when a group of ice climbers stumbled upon the frozen body of a soldier from World War II. The soldier, who was still wearing his military uniform, had apparently died during a secret mission in the mountains of Northern Italy. His body had been preserved in the ice for over 60 years, providing a haunting reminder of the sacrifices made during the war. But the frozen soldier is just one of many war relics that have been discovered in recent years. In 2009, a team of researchers discovered the wreck of a World War II-era plane at the bottom of the Black Sea. The plane, which had apparently made a controlled landing on the water, was found in remarkably good condition, with many of its original features still intact. Even more remarkable, are the discoveries of two ships from the ill-fated Franklin expedition of the 1840s. The HMS Erebus and HMS Terror, which had set out to find the Northwest Passage, disappeared without a trace in the Arctic ice. For over 150 years, the fate of the ships and their crews remained a mystery. But in 2014 and 16, the wrecks of the Erebus and Terror were finally discovered, thanks to a combination of modern technology and old-fashioned perseverance. The ships were found in remarkably good condition, with many of their artifacts and equipment still intact. The discovery provided new insights into the fate of the expedition and the incredible hardships that the crew must have endured. Number 15, the Lady of Empato. High in the Andes Mountains of Peru, at an altitude of over 20,000 feet, a remarkable discovery was made in 1995. The frozen body of a young Inca girl perfectly preserved for over 500 years. The mummy, who has come to be known as Mummy Juanita, or the Lady of Ampato, is one of the most remarkable finds in the history of archeology. span Juanita was discovered by anthropologist Johann Reinhard and his friend Miguel Zarate, who were exploring the slopes of Mount Ampato in search of Inca artifacts. As they climbed higher and higher, they spotted something unusual a bundle of brightly colored cloth partially buried in the snow. When they investigated further, they realized that they had stumbled upon something incredible, the frozen body of a young girl, adorned in elaborate Inca clothing and jewelry. Further analysis of Juanita's body revealed that she was between 12 and 15 years old at the time of her death, and that she had been sacrificed as part of a religious ceremony known as Capacocha. The Inca believed that by offering up the lives of young, healthy individuals to the gods, they could ensure the prosperity and well-being of their society. What makes Juanita so remarkable is the incredible state of preservation of her body. Despite being over 500 years old, her skin, hair, and internal organs are all intact, providing an unprecedented window into the lives of the Inca people. Scientists have been able to study everything from her diet and health to the intricate details of her clothing and jewelry. So, number 14, Ancient Ice Cave. In the rugged wilderness of Alaska, a remarkable discovery has been made. A series of ancient ice caves that are over 2,000 years old. 
These caves, which are part of the Mendenhall Glacier, offer a unique window into the past and a reminder of the incredible power and beauty of the natural world. The Mendenhall Glacier is a stunning natural wonder, stretching over 13 miles from the Juneau Ice Field to the waters of Mendenhall Lake. But it is what lies beneath the surface of the glacier that is truly remarkable. A series of hidden caves and tunnels carved out by the slow movement of the ice over thousands of years. The Mendenhall Glacier. Ice caves are a popular destination for adventurous tourists and scientists. Visitors can explore the twisting, turning passages of the caves, marveling at the incredible shades of blue and green that color the walls of ice. But it is what these caves can tell us about the past that is truly fascinating. Scientists believe that the ice caves of the Mendenhall Glacier are over 2,000 years old, formed during a time when the glacier was much larger and more expansive than it is today. By studying the layers of ice and the debris that has been trapped within them, researchers have been able to piece together a picture of what the climate and environment of Alaska were like thousands of years ago. Number 13. Glacial Sinkholes in the vast, icy expanse of Greenland, a series of strange and mysterious holes have been discovered. Holes that are both beautiful and terrifying in equal measure. These holes, known as moulins, are glacial sinkholes that funnel meltwater from the surface of the ice sheet down to the bedrock below. Moulins are a natural feature of glaciers, formed by the slow movement of the ice over time. As the ice melts on the surface of the glacier, the water trickles down through cracks and crevasses, eventually forming a vertical shaft that can reach hundreds of feet deep. These shafts are often incredibly narrow, with walls of ice that are smooth and polished by the constant flow of water. But moulins are more than just a natural curiosity. They play a crucial role in the complex interplay between ice, water, and climate on our planet. As the Earth continues to warm due to climate change, more and more meltwater is being produced on the surface of glaciers and ice sheets. This water has to go somewhere, and moulins provide a direct conduit for it to reach the bedrock below. Once the water reaches the bedrock, it can have a profound impact on the behavior of the glacier. The water can lubricate the base of the glacier, causing it to slide more quickly over the underlying rock. This can lead to a phenomenon known as glacial surge, where the glacier suddenly accelerates and advances rapidly downslope. Number 12, sleeping alligators. In the swamps and wetlands of the southern United States, a remarkable creature has evolved to survive in one of the harshest environments on Earth. Alligators, the ancient reptiles that have roamed our planet for millions of years, have developed an incredible ability to withstand even the coldest of temperatures by literally freezing themselves in place. During the winter months, when temperatures can drop well below freezing, alligators will often find themselves trapped in the icy waters of their habitat. But rather than succumbing to the cold, these incredible animals have developed a unique adaptation that allows them to survive even the harshest of conditions. When the water begins to freeze around them, alligators will slowly allow their bodies to freeze as well, starting with their tail and working their way up to their head. As the ice forms around them, they will poke their snout up through the surface, creating a small hole that allows them to breathe. This incredible adaptation known as brumation allows alligators to enter a state of suspended animation, slowing their metabolism to a crawl and conserving energy until the weather warms up again. During this time, they will remain completely motionless, their bodies frozen in place until the ice begins to thaw. Number 11, frozen methane. Deep beneath the ocean floor, a strange and potentially dangerous substance lies waiting. Frozen methane, also known as fire ice. This icy compound is created under the extreme pressure and low temperatures found in the Earth's permafrost regions, and it holds within it a vast amount of energy that could one day power our world or possibly destroy it. Frozen methane is formed when methane gas is trapped within the crystalline structure of water ice, creating a solid substance that looks like ordinary ice, but is far more flammable. 
when brought to the surface and exposed to a flame, this fire ice will actually burn, releasing the methane gas trapped within. But while frozen methane may seem like a strange curiosity, it is actually a potentially vast source of energy. Experts estimate that there may be more energy trapped in frozen methane deposits than in all other fossil fuels combined. If we could find a way to safely extract and utilize this energy source, it could potentially power our world for centuries to come. Number 10. Frozen Volcanoes Deep beneath the icy surface of Antarctica lies a hidden world of fire and fury, a network of active volcanoes that have been frozen in time for millions of years. These subglacial volcanoes, which were only recently discovered by scientists, represent one of the most significant geological finds in recent history, offering new insights into the complex interplay between ice and magma. The discovery of these frozen volcanoes was made possible by a combination of cutting-edge technology and old-fashioned scientific curiosity. Using radar and other advanced imaging techniques, researchers were able to peer beneath the thick layers of ice that cover much of Antarctica, revealing a vast network of volcanic activity that had previously gone undetected. What they found was truly astonishing a series of active volcanoes that were still churning away beneath the ice, generating heat and gases that were slowly melting the surrounding ice and creating hidden lakes and rivers. These subglacial volcanoes are thought to have been active for millions of years, shaping the landscape of Antarctica in ways that we are only now beginning to understand. One of the most intriguing aspects of these frozen volcanoes is the potential role they may play in the future of Antarctica's ice sheets. As the planet continues to warm due to climate change, there is a growing concern that the increased heat and gases generated by these volcanoes could accelerate the melting of the surrounding ice, leading to a rapid rise in sea levels and other catastrophic consequences. Number 9. Subglacial Lake Life In the frozen depths of Antarctica, Beneath miles of ice lies a hidden world teeming with life. These subglacial lakes, which have been cut off from the rest of the world for millions of years, are home to an incredible array of microbes and other tiny organisms that have adapted to survive in one of the harshest environments on Earth. The discovery of life in these subglacial lakes was a true breakthrough in our understanding of the limits of life on our planet. In 2013, as part of the Willens Ice Stream Subglacial Access Research Drilling Wizard Project, researchers drilled through nearly half a mile of ice to reach Lake Willens, a subglacial lake located in West Antarctica. What they found was truly astonishing. A thriving community of microbes that had been living in complete darkness, in temperatures just above freezing, for millions of years. These microbes, which include bacteria and Arceaea, have evolved unique adaptations that allow them to survive in such extreme conditions. Some of these adaptations include the ability to extract energy from minerals in the surrounding rock, and the ability to survive in highly salty and acidic environments. But Lake Willens is just one of many subglacial lakes that have been discovered beneath Antarctica's ice sheets. Perhaps the most famous of these is Lake Vostok, a massive body of water that is buried beneath more than two miles of ice. Despite the extreme conditions, researchers have found evidence of microbial life in samples taken from Lake Vostok, suggesting that even in the most isolated and inhospitable environments, life finds a way. Number eight, Iron Age Tunic. In the rugged mountains of Opland County, Norway, a team of archeologists made a stunning discovery a 1,700-year-old wool tunic that had been perfectly preserved in the ice. The tunic, which dates back to around 300 AD, is the oldest garment ever found in Norway, offering an unprecedented glimpse into the clothing and culture of the Iron Age. The tunic was discovered in 2011 by a hiker who was exploring the Lendbreen Glacier in Norway's Jotunheimen Mountains. The hiker noticed a strange object poking out of the ice and alerted archaeologists who quickly realized the significance of the find. The tunic was carefully excavated from the ice and transported to a lab for analysis, 
where researchers were able to study it in incredible detail. What they found was truly remarkable. A fully intact wool tunic that had been expertly crafted using techniques that are still used today. The tunic was made from sheep's wool that had been spun and woven into a fine, dense fabric. It was dyed a deep red using a pigment made from the root of the matter plant, which was commonly used for dyeing in the Iron Age. But perhaps the most impressive aspect of the tunic was its state of preservation. Despite being buried in the ice for over 1,700 years, the tunic showed almost no signs of decay or deterioration. The wool fibers were still strong and supple, and the dye was still as vibrant as the day it was applied. Number seven, toxic mercury. In the frozen depths of the Arctic permafrost, a ticking time bomb lies waiting. A massive reservoir of toxic mercury that could be released into the environment as the planet continues to warm. This startling discovery, which was made by a team of researchers in 2018, has sent shockwaves through the scientific community and raised urgent questions about the future of our planet. Mercury is a highly toxic element that can cause serious health problems in humans and wildlife alike. When released into the environment, it can accumulate in the food chain, poisoning fish, birds, and mammals, including humans who consume contaminated seafood. The discovery of this massive reservoir of mercury in the Arctic permafrost is particularly alarming because of the sheer scale of the problem. Researchers estimate that there may be up to 15 million gallons of mercury trapped in the frozen soil, a staggering amount that could have catastrophic consequences if released into the environment. Number six, ancient giant virus. In the frozen depths of the Siberian permafrost, a monstrous creature has lain dormant for 39 years, an ancient giant virus that has been waiting patiently for the chance to awaken. This startling discovery, which was made by a team of researchers in 2014, has sent shockwaves through the scientific community and raised urgent questions about the potential risks posed by these long dormant pathogens. The virus in question, which has been named Pithovirus cybericum, is a true giant in every sense of the word. Measuring in at a staggering 1.5 micrometers in length, it is larger than many bacteria and even some eukaryotic cells. But while its size is certainly impressive, it is the virus's ability to survive for such an incredibly long time that has truly amazed scientists. When the researchers first discovered the virus, they were skeptical that it could still be viable after so many millennia trapped in permafrost. But to their astonishment, they found that the virus was not only intact, but also capable of infecting its host, a species of amoeba that is commonly found in freshwater environments. Now it's time for today's subscriber pick. What they discovered frozen in ice shocked the whole world. Recently, explorers in the frozen mountains of Siberia made a chilling discovery they stumbled upon a body partially encased in ice. The upper half appeared normal, but the lower half was a stark contrast, entirely black with a strange, almost otherworldly texture. It bore an eerie resemblance to the fictional character Venom. Authorities were immediately notified, and the area was sealed off. Researchers arrived on the scene, and the body was carefully removed for further examination. What could this be? Could it be an undiscovered species, a victim of some bizarre experiment, or something even more sinister? Let us know in the comments. Number five, woolly mammoths. In the frozen depths of Siberia, a remarkable series of discoveries have been made. The incredibly well-preserved remains of woolly mammoths, long extinct giants that once roamed the earth during the last ice age. These ancient beasts, which stood up to 11 feet tall and weighed up to six tons, have been found in such pristine condition that scientists are even considering the possibility of bringing them back to life through cloning. One of the most famous of these discoveries is Liuba, a one-month-old woolly mammoth calf that was found by reindeer herders in 2007. Liuba's body was so perfectly preserved that her skin, hair, and even internal organs were still intact. Scientists were able to study her in incredible detail, learning about her diet, her health, and even the cause of her death. 
she had apparently suffocated in a muddy river. But Liuba is just one of many woolly mammoths that have been found in Siberia's frozen soil. Other notable discoveries include Yuka, a young adult mammoth discovered in 2010, and Buttercup, a female mammoth found on an island off the coast of Siberia in 2013. These specimens have provided unprecedented insights into the lives of these ancient creatures, from their anatomy and behavior to their diet and habitat. Perhaps most intriguingly, the well-preserved nature of these woolly mammoth remains has raised the tantalizing possibility of bringing the species back from extinction through cloning. While the idea is still in its early stages, some scientists believe that it may be possible to use the DNA from these frozen specimens to create a new generation of woolly mammoths, a Jurassic Park scenario that could have profound implications for our understanding of the natural world. Number 4. Slurpy Waves On a frigid January day in 2018, the shores of Nantucket, Massachusetts, bore witness to a truly bizarre and mesmerizing sight the arrival of slurpy waves. These strange, slushy waves, which look like something straight out of a frozen dessert cup, are a rare phenomenon that only occurs under very specific conditions. Slurpy waves are created when the air temperature drops so low that the water in the waves begins to freeze as they crash onto the shore. As the waves slosh back and forth, the semi-frozen water is churned into a slushy consistency creating a surreal and almost otherworldly sight. On that particular day in Nantucket, the air temperature had dropped to a bone-chilling 12 degrees Fahrenheit, which is well below the freezing point of seawater. As the waves crashed onto the shore, they were instantly transformed into a slushy mix of ice and water, creating a spectacle that left beachgoers and photographers in awe. Number three, frozen mummies. In the remote Tarim Basin of western China, a series of incredible discoveries have been made. The well-preserved remains of mummies that date back over 2,000 years. These mummies, which have been dubbed the Tarim Basin Mummies, are remarkable for their Caucasian features and unique clothing, which suggest a complex history of migration and cultural exchange in the region. The Tarim Basin Mummies were first discovered in the early 20th century. But it wasn't until recent years that scientists were able to study them in detail. Using advanced genetic sequencing techniques, researchers have been able to trace the ancestry of these mummies back to an ancient Asian population that lived in the region thousands of years ago. What makes the Tarim Basin mummies so remarkable is their incredible state of preservation. Despite being over 2,000 years old, many of the mummies still have their skin, hair, and even clothing intact. Some mummies are so well-preserved that they almost look like they could wake up at any moment. One of the most famous of the Tarim Basin mummies is the Beauty of Xiaohe, a woman who died around 3,800 years ago. Her tall stature, long nose, and fair hair have led some researchers to speculate that she may have been of European descent, though genetic analysis has shown that she was more closely related to ancient Asian populations. Number two, Fukushima's ice wall. In the wake of the devastating 2011 earthquake and tsunami that struck Japan, the Fukushima Daiichi nuclear power plant found itself in a desperate struggle to contain the spread of radioactive contamination. One of the most innovative and ambitious solutions to this problem was the creation of an underground ice wall, a massive barrier of frozen soil that would block the flow of contaminated groundwater from the plant into the nearby ocean. The ice wall, which was completed in 2016, is an incredible feat of engineering that stretches for nearly a mile around the perimeter of the power plant. To create the wall, engineers drilled a series of 100-foot deep wells into the ground, then inserted a network of pipes that circulated a supercooled brine solution through the soil. As the brine solution flows through the pipes, it freezes the surrounding soil creating a solid barrier of ice that can block the flow of groundwater. The ice wall is designed to be self-sustaining, with the brine solution continuously circulating to keep the soil frozen, even in the face of Japan's hot summers. Creating the ice wall was a massive undertaking, 
requiring years of planning and construction, and a budget of over $300 million. But for the engineers and scientists working to contain the spread of radioactive contamination at Fukushima, it was a necessary step in the ongoing fight to protect the environment and public health. Number 1. Finger of Death In the icy waters of the world's polar regions, a strange and deadly phenomenon lurks beneath the surface, the Finger of Death. Also known as brinicles, these eerie underwater structures are actually tubes of ice that grow downward from the underside of sea ice, creating a deadly trap for any marine life unfortunate enough to swim too close. Brinicles form when extremely cold, and saline water is expelled from sea ice as it freezes. This supercooled brine is denser than the surrounding seawater, so it sinks downward in a plume, rapidly freezing any water it comes into contact with. As the brinicle grows, it creates a tubular structure that can extend for several feet below the sea ice. But while brinicles may look like something out of a science fiction movie, they are actually a very real and deadly phenomenon. Any marine creature that swims too close to brinicle risks being trapped and frozen within its icy grasp, creating an eerie underwater graveyard of perfectly preserved sea life. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.